Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Chris. This is Chester. This is Ruby. Today I'm going to teach Chester how to do the spin. All right, before we jump into the action here, I want to give a brief explanation of how you teach your puppy this trick. It's broken down into about three parts. I taught my Staffordshire Bull Terrier Ruby this trick when she was about Chester's age. I spread his training out about four days, about 15 minutes per session. That's a good chunk of time to train your puppy so they can kind of keep their focus and stay interested. So the first step you got to do is you got to really lure your, your dog with the treats that you have in your head. Try and make sure they're very high value treats so that they're very interested in what you're doing. And you just got to lead them around with your hand in that spin kind of motion. Once they do that, you incorporate the word spin, say yes, reward them with the treats, and repeat. As you're sort of moving along, you get into about step two, that's when you start to incorporate more of the hand gesture, which is kind of like a stirring motion with your hand. You can make up whatever you want, but I find that's the best one. Once they kind of get the understanding of what the word spin entails and what this hand motion is tied to, then you can kind of distance yourself a little bit from your puppy so that they're actually not following the treat as much as they are following your command and your hand gesture. And then the final step is obviously you, on your feet, you're no longer luring as much and they are responding to your voice and to the hand command. That's when you know you've got this trick licked. And so I'm gonna show you how I did this trick with Chester across about four days. Let's go. So there you have it. That's how I taught Chester how to do the spin trick. You have to be patient when you're doing this. Spread it across a few days. Keep training sessions fairly short when you're doing it. You have to figure out a way to communicate with them. You have to slowly incorporate the actual movement with the word and the hand gesture. So take your time, have a lot of fun. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks everybody for watching and we'll see you again next time.